Alright everybody, welcome back to a bit of uh, FTL Advanced Edition. Uh, by the way, I'm, I'm still going for my old goal, which is basically just to get to the final boss, and then if I die during the final boss, then I don't redo it. So let's uh, head over this way, and uh, see what kind of motherfucker is waiting for us here. Oh, there's a there's an asteroid field. Sure, let's go there. Oh no, there's a ship hiding. Okay, well, let's beam directly onto- What? Look at this- look at this wet ship layout. Like, they, they've changed the ship layouts. This one has weapons in the front, and the- This thing in the back, so... Well, let's take out his weapons. Let's fuck him. Alright, and we're gonna just go take over- Oh, I want to take over the rock guy, actually. Now, the question is, are, is the rock guy gonna be more reluctant to leave, uh, because of lack of oxygen? Uh-oh. Oh, uh, because they, they fucking... Okay, so now my clone bay's been hit. That's Im really important for me to heal. Because that's, uh... I'm not... I'm, I'm kind of worried. Okay, good. Let's just go do this. To get it missed. Okay, thank god. Because, uh, honestly, if, if he dies, it's a big problem. Okay, good. Now they have no uh, weapons against me. So let's just uh, let them come in. All right, nice. Strip it off. And one guy died. So uh, as I said, you don't have to do it right away. You have a couple seconds to basically put put all the the, the put power back into the 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 cloning bay, so they don't die immediately. All right, let's retrieve this guy. Uh, let's see here. I think we need to. Uh, actually, I shouldn't have put that much power in. Let's just wait for it to go back because, uh, because well, in the next sector, I think it's it still counts as being depowered, and we can't really do much else here. So, uh, let's go up here. Because I, I am looking around for a store, because I, I can probably buy some nice augments. Uh, there's a mercenary ship. Let's go fucking kill him. Uh, and once again, weapons bay, because that's the way I roll. And there we go, we took over the Mantis. Which is amazing. Now, the, the the AI, even for, let's say, that like the Mantises and stuff, they will still... Oh, look at this guy, he got stunned. Because he was a... They, ha, they have a stun one. Alright, uh, let's just go fix that ship. Oh, what, what, this guy really... Oh, they have a fucking med bay. What a bunch of assholes. Okay, go back over there. Let's go mind control you. Actually, let's see if the, the flak hits that at all. There we go. And let's go let's go let's go right into here, because then they'll have a lack of oxygen too. Uh oh. Fuck. I had an auto fire. Let's just go back. There we go. Oh, there you go. Now you can't heal. Go fuck yourself. Uh, uh, is he gonna go try and heal that? Oh, fuck. Go fuck yourself. Oh, and now we need to go bring that guy back to life. I mean, this guy. This guy's getting all the experience of that. Okay, so no more life signs. Yeah, let's bring this guy back. It's 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 a weird ship. But you see, every time they come back, they're like, this guy's actually really good at fighting anyways, what the fuck? Yeah, I didn't actually expect that. He's just, he's he's good at fighting anyways. I thought he'd be like, you know, kind of mediocre because of the fact he's died so many times. Let's, let's see how they compare. Yeah, look at this. One is like amazing at fighting and the other one's like, eh, kind of good. Interesting. I don't know what kind of weapons I'm going to do with this guy, but whatever. Alright, so there's a, a pirate and... He shuts down my engines with his hacking tools. Uh, they're barely operational, we move into tech. Not like the engines were really a big deal. Once again, beam directly into the weapons bay. Uh, let's see if there's another guy that isn't a... Uh, uh, look, there we go. And we can. I can't control who gets taken over. Uh, but I can... I don't know. Oh no, my doors. Go fix that. That does two damage, seriously. And imagine if I hit the clone bay. That would be a really terrible, t like, that would be a really bad time. And that, that rock guy just, uh, has a death wish. 
Dude, he's just targeting one guy now. Alright, there we go, we got him. Okay, and go back onto the shields there, please. So, um, I was hoping to get a store. Um, that's what I'm saving this money for, because I need to I need to both repair and, I don't know. Uh, so there's a distress beacon in a tiny asteroid belt. A small ship is struggling to maneuver through a field. Okay, asteroid, the, through the field. It's the asteroid field. A fucking dumbass drove into that. Uh, I hail them and offer assistance. Help our shields are dying, we won't last long. Fine, fine, I'll teleport you onto my ship. They refuse at first, but after another rock, uh, um, blast rocks their ship, they agree to beam aboard the ship. They say, thank you, but we really must return home to our families. If their planet needs us, them, apparently. And I'm sure we can muster up a reward. And I take them back and they... Oh, wow, they healed me for 10 health points. Well, that's fucking nice of them. That's the best planet. Would visit again. Uh, okay, and there's a store right here. So let's go straight to that store and let's go see what they have to sell. Uh, and they got a few small ships here. Okay, so here we go. I could buy sensors. Don't really see a point in that. Uh, ooh, 10% more recovery for scrap. That's that's good. You can also get the hacking subsystem, um, which I'm pretty sure we'll get an opportunity to use that maybe later in this this LP, but uh, for the time being now, or at least with one of the other ships that actually does that. Uh, they have like another combat drone. They've by the way they've rebalanced a lot of stuff in this game. I don't think I've mentioned that at all. I mean, we're gonna get the scrap recovery arm because that is the best thing to get. Uh, fuck sensors. Sensors can go fuck themselves. Uh, and I think we're good for everything else. Uh, do I want to sell anything? Uh, yeah, I want to sell this. Because I'm not using the, sh the shield thing, trust me. Yeah, you don't want it. Just trust me. Uh, I, I just find it to be a total piece of crap. I I've tried it already and I don't like it. Maybe, maybe I'll change my, my tune if I try the stealth ship again. But we'll see. Um, I even tried having two of them and they sucked. Uh, anyways, something I wanted to mention, some things got buffed and nerfed here, uh, mostly in weapon prices and things like that, uh, but one of the more obvious things I did notice is this. Piloting uh, is automatic, 50% evasion with one point, and 80% evasion with two points. That's actually really good. Uh, before it was 25 and then 50, so you would only get at its most as half evasion, nobody would ever get it. But now there's actually kind of maybe a point to it, so that's kind of fun. Um, the rest of this is like pretty much standard as as far as I can see. I think maybe you get more oxygen. I'm not I'm not entirely sure now. Uh, I don't remember. But you know, it's 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 kind of cool stuff. Anyway, since uh oh man, I was gonna get another pointed shield, but we'll we'll wait until we get a bit more scrap because I won't have enough for to power it. I, I just want at least one more point. Cause I don't, I, I keep my, the flak on, oh there you go, that solves that problem. I keep the flak on all the time and I don't need to, so there you go. Now I got two point, two points of the shields. So we're just gonna go explore over here, a little corner of the galaxy. Oh look, it's a asteroid field. Wow! Okay, well let's not even bother leaving this ship because he's gonna just fucking die. This is the worst place for him to be. Why, why would they station this in an asteroid field? They're not, they're not very intelligent if you ask me. Oh no, he shot a bean at me, the insult. I'm gonna have to stop this LP just because I'm insulted. And the asteroid's gonna finish him up, isn't it? Yep, that's it. He, he hit me with a laser. How will I fucking take the dishonor, uh, dishonorment or whatever? I don't know, I, I was gonna say something with that, but whatever. Fuck you. Don't judge my lack of English. Uh, okay, there's a mercenary ship, go fuck yourself. We're gonna attack you. Uh, we don't need to delay the rebels, we are the rebels. Alright, so he's got, he's got a flat can as well. Uh, so, I need to go probably port onto my ship. And let's go, let's go take one of these motherfuckers over. There we go. Oh look, two engines are gonna come fight me? 1v1 me. So, here, here you can see that now, the flat can is really good at penetrating shields. It is amazing for that. Uh, it's kind of one of the interesting things about that they, they do with this, uh, this mechanic. So, it does have kind of a point, but also people, look, it looks like they get really good at evasion too. Ah, oh, it's kind of cool all the same. So when you see it being used against me, like this guy is getting, look at that fucking engine skill. Good job. I should probably put some more into evasion. Okay, well now now they can't do anything. 
so let's just go finish them off. And that's it. We strip off their ship and uh, we stripped it good. So we're done. Uh, and what should I put points into now? Is the question. On the ship called Canned, which now is really an awkward name now that I realize it. Uh, I, I did say I wanted more evasion. I, I do want more mind control as well, but we'll, we'll, there'll be time for that. Just one more point, because, you know, uh, it's it's cheap. Oh, here we go. One of the new uh, uh, event, like kind of events kind of thing. Uh, senses go wild as a nearby pulsar is detected. Uh, and so a pirate sneaks up on us. Okay, so pulsar is one of the new mechanics of this game. So obviously I can't get through, can't beam through Sultan Shield. It's gonna EMP random systems on my ship, which is kind of cool actually. But I need to take down that. I just need one more hit in. Okay, so shields went down, oxygen went down, and it went down like completely. Like there's like three of them. And unfortunately, he was not affected because he's got his stupid ass bolt of resultant shield. Uh, and beam this guy directly into weapons bay. Now, uh, there's not much I can seemingly do about this. Uh, luckily, we have evasion now. There we go. Now we're back to full shields. Shields went down again. Luckily, I'm, I'm taking out their weapons, so. All they have is that stupid stun thing now. Smartest thing to, to take out, obviously. I like how the guy kind of came in the room and was like, nope. So this is not actually a particularly threatening anomaly, because it, I mean, it takes out oxygen if that's really important too. Okay, where the fuck is the last guy? Oh, they have a clone bay? Those motherfuckers. That's for, that's only we can use that. Okay, so now they're gonna die. I didn't realize they had that. Motherfuckers. But now now they're not gonna come back to life. Uh, he doesn't he doesn't go heal it, he doesn't realize I needs it. Oh fuck, he exploded. Alright, while well, all the crew's dead, we take the fuel out of storage. And let's beam these guys back. Unfortunately I can't upgrade any systems while I'm here. Now it, it's kinda good to try and time my uh, my shields coming back up in case there's a Someone waiting for me because obviously the EMP still takes effect here. And now we're ready for to jump to the next sector. And oh, we just apparently a nearby station uh, just gave me a laser charger. So this is uh, the multiple time charging lasers thing. Um, I guess not that valuable, at least for me. So uh, I'm not into it. All right, so I guess we're gonna just go to the next sector, and we're gonna go to. We could go to a nebula just because we have no cameras, so it doesn't fucking matter. Let's go to a nebula then. Alright, and so, uh, all these jump, uh, jump beacons, something about whatever. Uh, I don't see any stores nearby, so. I still want to find a store. This upsets me. Because, I'm, this is why I'm saving up the scrap, but there's some really nice upgrades and augmentations you can get. And I sensed it out, and, uh,. We will take what is yours, and it's just a mantis ship. Fuck, mantis ship. Whatever. And there we go, we took over the NG. I was hoping to take over actually the, the fucking... The bug, but... The mantis, I know. Oh, don't hit me. They can't get through my... They can't penetrate shields, so... I, I, like, this is why I just take out their weapons, so then my ship is safe. By the way, one of the cool things that they've done to this game now is that you can actually... Um, you can have any subsystem you want, and you just have a limit now. So, the Federation Cruiser, for example, that couldn't have cloaking before, it can now have cloaking. Uh, according to the, the new, like, the game's new rules, so... Fucking, how much do they have on this thing? Whatever. I was like almost done killing the ship. I don't know why I had to take out weapons all the way. So we take out a take a bunch of their crap and we now beam back to our ship and live happily ever after. Uh no store yet. I'm gonna go to these two and then if not I'm gonna just fucking go buy something something else from the store. Oh, let's go attack the pirate. Oh, we charge up our weapons. Oh, he's got cloak? That motherfucker. Only we can have cloak. Okay, beam it to the weapons. 
Okay, how many people are going to come over here? Okay. So now they're hitting me with a missile. Um, not really much I can do about that. Oh no, my O2. I thought they were gonna. I thought for sure they were gonna fucking. Uh, uh, dude, I like how they're taking out their own guy though. It's incredible. Just fix the oxygen. Are you fucking kidding? We were just. We just fixed it. Like, like, god damn it! It's like uh, I don't know. Must be really fucking pissed right now. He's like, I just fixed it. Oh well, there goes my engines. This guy's gonna die soon. How much fucking, like, thing did they have in this? There we go. It's finally dead. Alright, so here we go. I need to put full power into that. Ah, oh, there we go. We got breach missiles. Cool. So that guy's coming back to life. I don't know what the fuck that guy was doing. He was just, like, bouncing all over the place. Okay, go, go fi fucking fix this, too. We're gonna do this just because I'm trying to equalize the air here, but I can't, so fuck it. There we go. Actually, these guys can go fix things in zero oxygen, so, you know, I don't know why I bother. So, as I said, this guy is low on health, but I can't really do much about that because there's no med bay. But he'll heal every time we jump, so it's actually not a big deal. Uh, so the mechanic, I think, it was kind of well made for that. And here's a store, finally. Alright, we got to keep the engines running. Alright, and let's see, so here we have some of the new stuff, uh, so let's see, we got sensors, obviously we know that, backup battery I've shown you before in the first episode, and obviously hacking, once again, we've already seen all that. We also have now a chain ion, which is, um, this, is, this one's kind of interesting, so, it, the ion damage increases every time it fires to maximum of 4 ion damage, so it's, it's good against, like, bosses and shit, I guess, because it gets really powerful, um, or like, really prolonged fights, as I said before, but, uh, you would only get that really if you're like, I don't know. I maybe should get a stun bomb because that sounds pretty good from a perspective of uh, like, you know, to, to, I don't know. You'd think it'd be good, but I, I, I don't really like it. Because it, it stuns my own crew as well. That's the problem with it. So I don't really know how to use it effectively. Uh, long range scanner is very, very good because then I get to see what's coming up next. That's very valuable to me. Um, and that's it. I don't have anything else. So uh, I can probably get rid of the emergency. Because I like the shield. The shield's charging faster. So crew takes half damage from low oxygen. Fuck that noise. Let's go get a shield charger instead. We don't really use drones, so that's okay. And let's go heal up. And we can probably sell something like the breach missiles. Although, you know, judging how this is a ship that's mostly about boarding, I wouldn't mind having something to just basically fuck, uh, go through, basically penetrate shields. So advanced flak is good for taking that Zoltan shields. Breach missiles are good for taking, like, if I can power that, I can, I can just go hit a system. But unfortunately, like, that's not very good against, uh, I don't know what I should do with this thing. You know what, Mark, I get it, because I'm not going to do three power into that. Fuck that. Alright, so that's it for that. Um, can I afford hacking? I can. Uh, and so we're going to get the hacking system then. Or maybe I should get a small bomb. Actually, I can get both. Why not, why not both, you know? This is our ship's final slot, so... That means I can't get a drone then. If I get hacking. And I was thinking of a drone to do... Uh... Uh, shooting down missiles, but fuck it, let's do hacking. Because we get all the new content in this LP. Okay, and now I also got small bombs, so now I can uh, target systems with that. Which is good. Uh, so we only need one power in, in, in the weapon, so you know that will, that will work fine. And I think we're all good to go. So now with the advanced sensors though, we can now see uh, where ships are. So we can actually intentionally go after uh, ships that we want to kill. Which is totally what I will be doing right now. And it's a rebel ship that he's stationed to look for me to attack him. Fuck that kid. What's he gonna do to me? I'm the, I am the Mantis boarding ship. Alright, and so some guys in here attacking me. Go help him out. It's a team effort. 
I mean, honestly, if someone dies, it's not a big deal. I'm just using him as a kind of a meat shield for the Zoltan who's already wounded. That's it. He's dead. Oh, and go fix the fucking shields, because they got through somehow. It's fucking magic. He's a wizard. So, luckily there's no health here either, but, you know, as I said, I have the small bomb for this kind of shit, so... This is this is a good combination of weapons, to be honest. They're very synergetic, for especially for a boarding ship. You know? Just finish off the weapons, for fuck's sake. There you go. That's so hard. Okay, and let these guys kill each other. And there we go. No more life signs. We strip it off of remaining whatever. And bring these guys back. Alright, cool. And Schlong is almost dead. Maybe I should just let people die so they heal, but... I don't know. I guess I'm not that big of an asshole. There is... Um, a nebula experiencing an ion storm. So that would... That's going to drain my power by half, but it'll drain their power by half too. So you know, I can prepare by having one more power. And YOLO, fuck it. Let's go do it. Alright, so we're going to put only one power into the, the teleporter bay. Go into their weapons. You know what we can even do? Watch this. Let's fucking take all the power out of it. I just guy has to walk all the way around. Oh, and... And now we took... Oh, we, we don't take power out of it. Fuck. Because it, it already has one power to put in. Ah, well, that sucks. Well, let's go get this guy back faster. No, my weapons, which I don't need. Oh, what? He, they, they have a fucking anti-personnel drone. Oh, whatever. I'll just let them both come back and we'll, we'll make another run. Uh, maybe not, actually. I really want my weapons back so I can hit their dr drone bay. Let's just wait for them both to come back. This is not good because they're, they're just getting free hits off on me. Okay, let's try take two. Except uh, this time we're going to take out their S-bomb. Um, we're going to take out the drone bay. Oh, well, mind control. I didn't really use it last time, so let's try it. Okay, come on, come on. S-bomb, S-bomb, go. Go, S-bomb, I choose you. Oh, God. They, they still have enough. I don't know why. Oh, because they have more power into that. This is not this is not a fucking good fight. There we go. Okay, now that now that thing's dead. And I don't know, full power to I don't know what to put full power into. That? Okay, sure. Okay, take out their weapons really quickly, please. Please. There we go, thank goodness. Uh, now we can go to fucking fix uh, uh fix mind control. No, don't fucking fix that. Oh, they have a fucking robot to fix that for them. Why is that guy... Oh, because I, I removed all the power from oxygen. Oh, well, let's just do this. There we go. Actually, let's go over here. There we go. And that solves that problem. Now they don't. Uh, yeah, we don't need to kill that guy. The ship has been empty, emptied, and we find a prisoner that joins our crew. So another, another motherfucking Zoltan joins our crew, and I guess I'm gonna have this person on shields because I don't always power weapons, and that means this person gets to just fuck around here. That was kind of a more difficult fight, but as you can see, the the, the reason why the um the the clone bay is so fucking good. Is because of the fact you get to just you get to you get to screw up, and it just brings the, the people back to life. So it's it's like it's like the possibly like the greatest thing because it's just like oh I fucked up it's okay he'll come back. All right, oh that's a drone and it's gonna fucking run away. So we need to power that. We need to get shields up. Uh, do that. And well, there's no point in this. Oh wow, okay I didn't realize I wasn't uh, moving anywhere. Okay, we're, we're gonna go here first just to prevent him from leaving. Because we can pretty much get free, free reign over a ship. We can hack him, by the way, to de deplete the FTL. By the way, if you want to know what some, like, hacking drone does, like, I just hover over them with this. 
and it grant uh, ev I can make evasion zero, evasion zero. But once again, this does delay the FDL. I can drain his shields, or I can temporarily drain charge from enemy weapons. I just haven't really seen an opportunity to use it really. So, oh no, you fucking, oh no, my O2. I mean, you're not doing anything. Oh. Oh, I thought that would, thought that would maybe kill him, so. Oh, let's just kill the shields. I mean, there's no point in him staying there, so. Actually, there is. Fuck. There we go, now he's dead. Eh, that's it, we got some, some, uh, scrap out of that. So I, I'm gonna actually upgrade my clone bay all the way, so I now get, like, the full heals every jump. So that's, and as I said, you don't have to power it at all. But it's gonna it's gonna revive like 25% of the HP, which is you know pretty nice uh, just for like the crew on the ship as well, you know. So it's it's good all the way. It's a very very good ability. I like it. Uh, all right, so let's go to the next place and attack the pirate. Oh, they fucking cloaked. Uh, this one, this ship looks kind of shitty because it just it doesn't have many weapons. But I have to wait for it to fucking stop. Fucking longest cloak in, in the world, like, holy shit. Alright, and we're gonna just take over that guy. Come on, everyone. Now, there is an augment for the clone bay. If someone dies while the clone bay is unpowered, uh, you can have it so that uh, their DNA is stored, so you don't lose them. You can you can power it up whenever. That's also a very good one to have, um, especially in my case, because if this thing like with with three bars, it's very unlikely now to go down completely. That's kind of the one of the reasons you do go for the three bars, because you don't lose the crew members then. Very, it's not very expensive to do it either, you know. But you know, it's, it's still a nice thing to have. All right, and that guy just fucked up. Well, come back here. We, we miss you. Okay, so now we go put. Let's see how fast it gets him back now. And we got a pike beam out of that. Nice. Yeah, you see, it brings it back. And if I slow it, I can slow it down if I want. If I like to take my time. And there we go. Well, not exactly the most challenging of boarding ships, but you know. And then I'm gonna speak too soon and then it's gonna just fuck me. But you know, that's, that's part of the fun of my Let's play this. Oh, here we go. Oh, this is good. You also get new blue events. So, Black Market Trader uh, warns me of the tails before pushing his wares. So, he wants to uh, do an unknown weapon. I can mind control and convince him to make a better deal. The convinced help he casually states that his offer was actually a lie and he planted to attack your ship. By the time he returns to his senses, you've already prepared for fright. So, blue doesn't exactly mean good. That's crazy. It doesn't mean you're guaranteed to get a good outcome. Um. Uh, we're, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna S-bomb his clone bay. Beam it to here. Oh, that's an NG there. Oh, whatever, fuck you, NG. I don't know why he ran away. I mean, you, you, you can make a clone of yourself. There we go. That handles that. We're gonna have to go there in just a second. Uh, it's just an EMP bomb, but fuck it. It's just, you know, make sure we kill it. I know he's healing it. Yeah, he just healed it. Fuck you. I'm gonna take it out again. No clone for you. That's it. He's, we're, we're back. Uh, and one more point into the... That. I'm not really using the hacking, I know, but I haven't really... I, I have it as an opportunistic thing, so... You know, I, I, I haven't had really the opportunity to that would really warrant me using it, to be honest. Uh, and there's a merchant that shows me his wares. So we can go back to the med bay if we want to. And we can also get a backup better if we truly want to. Uh, okay, here's a nice one. Zoltan Shield Bypass. We can teleport through Zoltan Shield, and the mind control works through it too. 
Uh, there's also, uh, this is another new one. Explosive Replicator makes it so that weapons have a, a f missiles of a 50% chance not to be used. Uh, both are good options. Uh, we could also get cloaking, but obviously we've reached a system limit, so uh, I guess we're kind of fucked for that. Uh, so we're going to remove... Fuck. I don't know. I like scrap still, so let's get rid of the shield thing. So we're going to get the Zoltan uh, shield bypass. Means we don't really need the advanced flak anymore, but we'll keep it around anyways, just because I'm lame. Uh, and I don't think I'm gonna get much out of going there, so I'm gonna just go up here and go out. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna track the rebel ship as we go and engage, and we're in firing range now. So now we can go just into his weapons bay. This is something that we really want to take up fast, because that big ass weapon looks really threatening. Okay, so they're trying to get into my shield bay here, so let's just start venting atmosphere. So I'm not, I'm not very good at fighting. Oh, now they don't want to fight me anymore. I mean, I, I have the S-bomb at my disposal, but I really haven't felt the need to get it. Oh, one of the cool things is, um, you know, just for fun. Uh, well, we only have seven drone parts. So I guess we're not going to do it. I can, I can take control of the enemy teleporter, returning the crew to the enemy ship. That's one of the, the hack things you can do. Uh, it's just vent the atmosphere from this place. You can have that room. Oh, we apparently don't aren't powering it all the way because I I have the Zoltan in there. Cool, okay. Alright, so that's good. Let's just go over here and wait for him to go attack me. And just go attack him too. There we go, no life signs on the ship, strip it of anything that's on it and come back. Alright, and uh, I guess that's good for that. And straight to the exit then. Holy fuck, this was a long episode. Uh, okay, so I can sell missiles for scrap. I'll sell... F five. Fine. And then we're done with this one. I didn't realize I was like at 30 fucking two minutes. Jeez. I'm sorry. Well, well not really. Long episodes. Deal with it. Uh, that's all the time we have for today, and we'll see you next time. Bye.